We've received several questions about the ways doctors and nurses are treating people hospitalized with COVID-19. Tonight, we're taking a closer look at one that UAMS describes as a game changer in the fight against the virus. It's called monoclonal antibody treatment, and as THV 11's Mercedes McKay shows us, it's helping save lives. They've been using the treatment here at UAMS since around December, and it's turning several patients fight against COVID-19 into victories. Very grateful because I would not have appreciated the other road that I could have taken by not receiving it. Kathy Luter was diagnosed with COVID-19 on July 27th. I ached all over, runny nose, coughed all night long, had to sit up in order to breathe just to sleep. And I was miserable. Back in December, Luter was a nurse at UAMS working in their infusion clinic. Little did the 62-year-old cancer survivor know she'd be the patient sitting in that chair months later. I'd do this again in a heartbeat. Just, I cannot imagine how quickly it reacted for me. I feel very, very good. Just one infusion and one week later, Luter is back to feeling like herself again. She's one of the over 500 patients at UAMS who have received the monoclonal antibody treatment. We have very few tools in our kit that have been proven to be effective at COVID treatment, and this is one of those three or four treatments. UAMS infectious disease specialist Ryan Dare says with just one 30-minute IV infusion, the antibodies can block the virus from attaching to human cells and progressing infection. It's improving outcomes, it's decreasing hospital admissions, it's decreasing deaths. Um, we know that the sooner you get it, the less likely you are to get admitted. The treatment is recommended for high-risk patients like someone who's older or immunosuppressed. Dare says it can decrease their chance of hospitalizations or death by 70%. This is the only therapeutic option for patients to take in the outpatient setting to prevent getting sicker. Time is of the essence. I would recommend it for anybody. It's a small investment of your time for a great reward. In Little Rock, Mercedes McKay, THV 11 News. Thanks so much, Mercedes. As COVID-19 cases and hospitalizations are up in Arkansas, so are vaccination rates. This is good news here. 30,756 doses of the COVID-19 vaccine were administered today across the state. That's the most doses given in one day since April. Just over 14,000 more Arkansans became fully vaccinated in the last day, and almost 1.4 million people are at least partially vaccinated now. Nearly 2.4 million shots have been given, a little more than 82% of the state's supply.